Good morning and welcome to day 14 on the PCT. I'm looking for rattlesnakes. Not that I expect to find any in this weather, but we are in rattlesnake country and I don't want to get bit. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> it's a blustery, rainy day again. Uh, but it's nice and cool, and it's a perfect day to hike, in my opinion. experiencing necessarily a super bloom here. The flowers in the desert are just amazing. If I don't stop videotaping them or taking pictures of them, I am never getting to Canada. <laughs> And we're off. Like a herd of turtles, my dad used to say. Today is going to be a very slow day. My tummy is still a little upset. I don't want to speak for the other members of my trail family, but it seems like we're all sort of still fighting something. So we're just gonna do nine miles today nine miles the next day and eight miles into Warner Springs. And I feel very comfortable with that. Plus it's a gorgeous day. How could you not be happy out here right now? So slow, slow, slow is the name of the game today. Day 14 on the PCT. Can you see the trail cut into the side of the mountain right there? Isn't that so beautiful? The desert is so full of life. It's, it's just unreal. The birds, I've seen so many different types of birds and bumblebees and I haven't seen any lizards or snakes yet because it's still a little, oh my God. Oh, 
They're just so beautiful. Let me see if I can get this. Oh, there's a hawk. Do you see the hawk? I'm not sure if you can see him. But there's all these little, I don't know what they are, chickadees or something. Down this hill. There must be like hundreds of them. I can't videotape them very well, but can you hear them? Oh, they're so beautiful. the sun doo -doo -doo -doo. here comes the sun and I said it's all right for copyright reasons I'm gonna let you guys finish the rest of that beautiful song <laughs> just know that's what's in my head right now Okay, I'm supposed to fit through there. Come on now, maybe this direction? Look at that. Okay, here we go. What could possibly go wrong? Um, okay, I'm not gonna fit through this hole. Oh, there's barbed wire. Uh, what if I got stuck and somebody had to come rescue me? Maybe that's going to go on my obstacle list tonight, trying to get through the gates on the PCT with this huge backpack. <laughs> it's good to be free. I'm in this wash here to use the bathroom and there's mountain lion tracks everywhere. So I'm getting the fuck out of here. No, it's my understanding that they're nocturnal, but uh, I'm really low. There's a lot of mountains around me that are high. Look at that. Easy for the pick in here. I don't feel safe. So I'm gonna put a little hustle in my bustle and get to the top of this mountain here.
There they are, Jimmy. Here's your mom and your aunt. And the poppy fields are getting water. <laughs> It's a bit exciting to sign a register on the PCT. It's the end of day 14, and in honor of um, Sparky, who went ahead today, she went ahead of us, uh, I'm having a peanut butter ramen, which I've never done before but it's apparently a very common trail food so uh, she seems to like it so I'm gonna try it uh, as far as my success today I reached my stretch goal of 10 miles my expected mileage today was 8 and we stretched it to 10 and uh, I'm very happy about that uh, I can't wait for the day that I do 10 before 10 a.m. Uh, although it seems impossible. Um, my difficulties today were the last two miles. I... I'm camping on a ridge. It's very windy. Um, okay, so the last two miles were difficult because that little devil in my head wouldn't shut up <laughs> about how hard it was and how I couldn't make it and I'm not strong enough to be out here and, you know, all those terrible things that my brain tends to tell myself. Which leads me into my um, blessings or my gratitude today is my dear friend, Betsy, who told me before I left, I can do hard things. Please hold. And um, she's absolutely right. I can do hard things and sometimes I forget that. And today, while I was walking up a mountain for two miles at the end of the day, it was cold, it was raining, it was very windy. We were on an exposed cliff. And I just kept saying, I can do hard things. <laughs> I can do hard things. So, Betsy, thank you so much for reminding me of that. And um, she's absolutely right. So I'm going to go to bed because it's going to be a long night and I want to just get cozy and fall asleep. Thank you so much for joining me today. It was an absolutely amazing day. And, uh, and I'm really proud of myself. I'm really proud of what I accomplished. So have a wonderful evening and I'll see you next time.